What's on that? Hey, Mr. Arbonne's on me? Yes, sir. For what? So fake check. This fake something that's check in the mail. It's it's yeah, it's counterfeit. I just spoke with Natalie over at this company, Prodigy Brands, Brands, and she said that she's getting calls from all over with these fake checks going to different check cashers. Okay. We don't write checks. Okay. Okay. It goes through ADP. ADP. Direct deposit. That's the app where you check like your check stubs so, and shit. One second, I can tell you if Derek Darby ever worked for us. I really feel like he's not lying. Oh, see, dude, I, never I feel like he's not lying. What number was that that he uh, tried to cash in? For how much? For eight twenty three sixty four. Yeah, they keep it in the eight hundred range. That's not. Hey, I, I low key think about it, bro. Like I'm thinking this shit. Like I'm thinking a check like fifteen hundred. Like I got check. I got fake checks right now. Hold on, y'all. Y'all ain't hear me say that at all. I did not just say I got fake nothing, bro. Hey, sub the fuck up, y'all. Sub the fuck up. You feel me? Let's get it, bro. We got a uh, we got ca co we got a nigga trying to cash a fake check, bro. Um, I been reading y'all hate comments, bro. I just wanna let the haters know I appreciate y'all, bro. You know, if you don't got haters, that means you doing something wrong, bro. Everybody gonna hate when they know you got something going on good, bro. And I ain't gonna lie, I almost fed into the hate, bro. But you gotta realize, real message, the message of this video, the message of this stream is, bro. Do what's best for you, bro. Don't worry about the hate, bro. You, If you ain't got no haters, bro, you not doing nothing, right? If you got haters, bro, keep adding them bitches up, nigga. The, keep building more haters. Niggas hating on you for a reason because they, they like what you doing. They mad what you got, what you got going on, folks. Keep doing you, bro, regardless of what the fuck people say. September 29th, 2023, officers responded to a reported case of check fraud. <laughs> I'm gonna let you, uh, I'm gonna take your information so I can have the officers speak to you, okay? What are you doing? What's going on? I'm not entirely sure yet, but I got calls, I guess, for you. I just told you, I don't know. Are you causing a scene? That they weren't in trespass? No, I'm not. It's on it. Mr. Arbonne's on me? Yes, sir. For what? Yes, sir. He don't get no fuck. He said, nigga said, yes, sir. He don't get no fuck, bro. It's on that. Mr. Arbonne's on me? Yes, sir. For what? It was just counterfeit, sir. I called the company and they said they told me about the police because the shit is bullshit. And it ain't no good. They just tell me that. Oh, okay. Yeah, they tell me that. Tell him all of this. Okay, I got a little five, ten. So, so fake check. This fake check in the or? Mail. It's it's yeah, it's counterfeit. I just spoke with Natalie over at this company, Prodigy Brands, Brands, and she said that she's getting calls from all over with these fake checks going to different check cashers. Okay, so where, where did, that, where did you get the check? It's, it came to me in the mail. Did so you I ever guess, work for them? Is that their I guess they you? must be. So, I guess they sitting them out there by the Prodigy. Yeah, I went in for a couple of days, but. That's the only thing. days, okay. Like seven, seven, eight days, but then oh, my thing is, right, you have ID. Uh, yeah. All right, All right so, so look. You got the so look. I low key believe that he not lying, but at the same time, nigga, if I get a check in the mail, bro, knowing that I ain't got nothing coming in no mail, bro, I'ma know it's fake, right? Well, I'ma try to see if it's fake. What she tried to do, but why would you go to your fucking? Why would you go to a corner store to try to see if it's fake? First of all, Ale's corner store cashier, bro. He an ill man, bro. Cause you feel me? It seems like that nigga be coming to him all the time, like he know him for real. And if he know him for real, why is you calling the police? Yes, this bitch just told you on the phone to call the police. You don't. That bitch not here to to really see if you call the police. You could have just. I'm sorry for calling her, bitch. I told y'all I gotta stop doing that. It's it's in my language, bro. But that girl not here to see if that if. He really in jail or not, bro. You could have just been like, hey, look, it's a fake, fake check. But, you know, I rock with you, so I'm just going to let you know this is a fake check. So, if, if you try to come ahead again with this fake check, then I'm going to have to call the police. Or I just advise you to just to leave that check alone. It's a fake check. Because that's my mans. You feel me? That's what I do, bro. Real nigga activity, bro. Then, on top of that, why would you go to a corner store to try to cash it at this at the store that you go to, you go to this store all the time to get shit, bro. Now, you can't even go to your corner store no more. Let's do your homework on that, bro. Like, come on, bro. Oh, uh, let me see my ID. I don't even need to see my ID. 
I kind of believe though. Turn it on, you know we ran that, man. I told they you. Send them, they must be sending them out there. But you say she, she got a lot of calls? Yeah, I gave it up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So they get a lot of calls about these texts on? You already know that, bro. I don't know. Stay the obvious, bro. Come on, man. Come on, Tony. Come on, bro. Come on, dog. Me, bro. All right, me, yeah, so you, bro. So come on, man. Back. What you doing to me, bro? You come and hustle me. You come and scam me. This is the definition of scams. I'm about to check to you, bro. You gave me half real money, half fake money from an income tax. I ain't do all that. Hold on. I remember I brought a check to you, bro. You gave me half real money, half fake money. Wait, 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 wait. He said I brought a real check to you, gave me half fake it. Oh. What you doing to me, bro? Come and hustle me. Come and scam me. This is the definition of scams, sir. I remember I brought a check to you, bro. You gave me half real money, half fake money from an income tax. I ain't do all that. Let me shoot a call Secret Service on me, bro. all that, bro. Brought you the money back, bro. Can I get ah, information? Hold on. So it seemed like... Okay, so look. My bad. I know y'all be like, man, this fuck I be pausing, but I just got something to say. So if he did do that, right? You know, get him some fake money for income tax, whatever, right? So it seemed like he brought that fake check, if he knew it was fake, back to him. Because he like, oh, shit, he be doing that shit anyway. So he probably a lookout, or he probably could give me some more fake money that I could go take somewhere else that just, you know, just a little hustle or whatever, right? But he did but now, if that was a situation, he probably thinking, the cashier probably thinking, like, oh, I think his name Mike. Mike probably thinking, like, oh, okay, cool, so, all right, best. So, what you do, you try to police or something, you bring a fake check to me, try to see, try to, or something like shit like that, or he probably, like, I don't know, he an ill man regardless, bro, but that's what I think, bro. Yeah, I wrote I'm going to shut up for now, I promise, I promise, I promise. Yeah, I take a picture of it, right? Oh, okay. Yeah, now he's just coming here with some bullshit. Hey, uh, Natalie? Yes, it is. All right, okay, I've got an officer here. Yo, what the fuck Thank you, hi. Hi, how you doing? It's Officer Press. Okay, how are you? Oh, so, so, what's going on? You didn't send so us I don't check know if, I don't know if I spoke to you about 10 minutes ago, but there was another check cashing store right. that called me with a check from Kevin Jordan. Kevin Jordan. He sent me his ID for $880.23. Right. He tried to cash in a check. I told the guy this is the fourth time in two days that I get calls from check cashing stores. So do yourself a favor, call the police, hold them off, tell them yes, you'll cash it in, call the police, and have them get there immediately. They right. did and the guy ran. But they have his ID, Kevin Keith uh, Jordan. Yeah, this is a different one who apparently worked for your company, I guess. So when he got the check in the mail, he just figured it was his last paycheck. No, 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 who, Kevin Jordan never worked for us? No, Derek no, no, Darby. Derek Darby. Oh, Derek Darby. Okay, we don't get... One second, I can check right now on ADP. We don't write checks. Okay. Okay? It goes through ADP. ADP. Direct deposit. That's the app where you check, like, your check stubs so, and shit. one second, I can tell you if Derek Darby ever worked for us. Okay. I really feel like he's not lying. I feel like he's not lying. What number was that that he uh, tried to cash in? For how much? For $823.64. Yeah, they keep it in the 800 range. That's not, hey, I, I low key think about it, bro. Like, I'm thinking this shit, like, I'm thinking a check, like, 1500. Like, I got check, I got fake checks right now. Hold on, y'all. Y'all ain't hear me say that at all. I did not just say I got fake nothing, bro. What I'm saying is, I know niggas who got fake checks, hypothetically. I know a nigga who told me he had a fake check, right? Hypothetically, right? And I kept it, hypothetically, bro. And, uh, it was over about, like, $3,000, right? So I'm like, okay, niggas like that, that is big money. But G, you called the police over eight hundred dollars, bro. He real, I think, I believe this man, bro. I real like think he think this was his last check, G. But I don't know, bro. Okay, one second. Let's look at terminated employees. Okay, terminated employees. Okay, let's look at terminated employees. Terminated. He said he wanted to terminate, but he said he left. He never showed back up. So what did you say the name was? Derek Darby? Yeah, Derek Darby. Ah. I believe that's man, nope. bro. Never had a Derek Darby work for us. Hey, Miss Nancy. I'm the guy that came in for the six days and walked off. You're the other guy that what? I'm sorry? I'm the guy that came in for the six days and walked off. Apparently he worked for six days and then never came back. My name is Derek Darby. I came in for the six days and walked off. You came in for 
for six days and walked off. Yeah, so remember what, I got into so it with you. With you got a written guy. check? Is that what you did? No, I, I got a check no, in the mail. He got a check in the mail. It's printed out. What check number is it? Uh, 4390. Okay. That's fraud. We don't have checks with that number. So who gave you that check? Because it's certainly not us. So yeah. where is the return? Nope. Who, who sent you that? These checks they get, I, I got that stuff from him, man. I understand that, but who sent it to you? There has to be a return address. Oh, the, the letter's at my the letter's at my house. I got this because my dog almost ate it up, but I got this for this at my house. The return address from the place? 35 years. Yeah. And where that where was the return address at? Came in, this, this came in that letter. I know, but... Hang on a second. Who did say sent you the check? This place. Hello? They, they, they got their name on. They got their name on the inside of the envelope and the outside of the envelope. Come on, man. You know I wouldn't damn well. Why wouldn't brought my ID up here, man? Yeah. Why would he bring his ID with a fake check? Who was the other police? Yeah. Why well, I ain't even think about that, well, Lokito? Let me let me ask you. If I'm cashing a fake you, check, why would I bring my you know, ID? I would never did that. Mm -hmm. I would just out of my child it before giving him an ID. Hello, like Natalie. This. Okay, hang on. Yeah, hang on a second. The officers asked me something. Who was the other police department that was getting the fake checks? Uh, so last year it was, one second, I just emailed him this morning with a copy on, of the yeah. check. Uh, his name was... Sent, one second. Uh, it was Officer... I Officer, real life uh, Jay, uh, uh, Jenkins. Officer Jenkins. Okay. Okay. Well, it was Delray Police Department. Okay. Oh, I'll give him a call then. See what's okay. going on. So that was in March 2022. I just gave him an update of new fraud checks, and I gave Fuck. him the one from Kevin Jordan. Hold on, y'all. Hold on, y'all. Oh my shit, the death. Hold on, y'all. I'll be right. I'm gonna be right, right back. I promise y'all, boys. The one you have there is also fraud, by the way. It's not us. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Who was that? I didn't even see that girl with him. Uh, yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Let me call the detective, see what's going on with that. Maybe people are sending random checks out to whatever. So that's what he just Let me call him and see what's going on. Hey, what's going on? Um, I guess Nancy from Boca Prodigy Brands. Okay, well, we just got another call. Someone, I guess, got it. He's saying he got a check in the mail from them. No, nah, we said he you worked do that. for six days. Okay, well, nigga. we just got another call. Yeah, look at this nigga scratch his ass. Got it. He's saying he got a check in the mail from them. He tried to cover it up like he was pulling his shirt and walked off. Um, so he got a check in the mail from them for eight twenty-three. And um, when Tony called the company, they said, "No, that's not our checks." So why did they come in the mail? So what do you? You have another guy? Okay. Same suspect? Not me. Not you. Okay. So it's that James or whatever his name is. Sorry. Kevin, she sent you Kevin Jordan? Or, yeah, Kevin Jordan. Okay. I'm telling you, but he did lie. Okay, I guess she just emailed he you. Tell the truth, I guess bro. they just try to catch your I bet y'all niggas ten dollars right now. Today, so she emailed you. Shake my head, nigga. Okay. That me up. Okay. Well. Yeah. Hey, chat. Y'all gotta chill with the comments, bro. Okay. Y'all wild. He's gonna talk to his supervisor to see what's going on. I guess specializes in fraud. He Do you know Kevin him. Jordan? No, I don't say. No. I'm telling you, bro, he didn't do shit. He didn't know about it. He looked calm, bro. He... I don't know why this shit looked calm. I'm thinking I just got I think I got some little extra money or something. You know what I'm saying? So you were know I did. I ain't even run from it. I brought my idea, everything. I ain't what, trying to run or none of that shit. You know what, that. What kind of company is this? They make different, all different types of stuff. 
Like, I speak that I can we go to the battle and I need to come on. Huh? I ain't, I no. Ain't huh? You can't go outside yet. I'm talking about with you, man. If you were going outside, you're getting put in handcuffs. I don't well, need you I, running from me. Okay, we can ask. What? Oh, okay. Okay. Can I put in handcuffs in? See, he didn't do shit, bro. Look at this man, he copped. Come on, bro. Let's give it up for this for this black man, bro. Give it up for this black man, bro. Young and educated. I mean, old and educated. Yeah, but like, like, like give it up, like, real t- <laughs> Give it up for this, for this man, bro. Black man. Black, black educated man, bro. Black educated man, bro. Come on, bro. Come on, bro. Look at this shit they got going through, bro. This shit is crazy, bro. W, uh, W women, bro. My nose stopped up. I can't say shit the right way, bro. W women. Woman. Y'all know what I'm saying, bro. <laughs> Stop playing me in the comment section, too. I see y'all niggas in the chat, bro. W men's, bro. Oh yeah, that's a random. Fuck that nigga. Thank you. Thank you. I don't speak English. Listen, if somebody wants a cigarette so bad they're nervous. I'm not nervous about what? Why the fuck you in a business? He, hey, don't fall for it. Hey, don't fall for that shit, bro. Niggas like him do shit like that on purpose, bro. Trying to geek your head up. He mad that that black man. He he comprehended that black man ain't do nothing wrong, bro. He did everything he was supposed to do as a uh, educated black man. Don't fall for that goofy ass shit, bro. Fuck that nigga, bro. Word to my moms, bro. Yeah, we fucking up the. We hold on, G. Did they get everything, bro? Nah, they got twenty two seconds of that shit, bro. These niggas fucking up the uh video, bro. Hey, hey, we gonna fix it though. We gonna fix it. Hey, don't fall for that shit, bro. Fuck that nigga, bro. He need to buy his fucking business, bro. Niggas be yapping. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Now your business. He just want look. He just want him to say something, bro. Don't fall for that shit. Fuck that nigga, bro. Fuck that nigga, bro. What's that, nigga, bro? Uh, is that your girl or is that your wife? Your wife? W wife. Do you have anything she wants to have? They're taking him. W wife. Do you have what they taking without taking him? Good thing. Mm-hmm. Oh, there's a text over there. Do you want anything that's in this? She just got one. Whatever, so, wallet, phone, whatever. That's it. Nothing? No. <clears throat> My wife need to come to the police station? W.I. I mean, she can wait if she wants, but it'll just be whatever the detective talks to you or something, and then W.I. Go from there. W.I. W.I. Bears, bro. Hey, he did everything he was supposed to do, bro. These are the type of videos I like to watch, bro. Y'all gotta send me more of these videos, bro. A person do what they supposed to be doing, bro. Y'all gotta send me more of these videos, bro. Y'all gotta send me more of these videos, bro. A person do what they supposed to be doing, bro. Thank you, bro. It's crazy, because low-key... Low key, the police kind of finessed them into the police vehicle because at first he he wanted the handcuffs until he said he wanted to smoke a square. And then the police was like, oh shit, you want to smoke a square? This is the, this the perfect time to arrest you. He thought he was going to act a fool about the cuss, but he didn't. He played his part, bro. That's W Mans, bro. W Wife, bro. Let's give it up. Come on, bro. For what? And that came in the mail. That check came to my house. Okay, in the hold mail. on. So how's he going to jail? So with what you could do is you could go to first appearance and you could argue with the judge because I don't sit here and argue so with people. So he said you finna talk. So he finna talk to a detective. So are you arresting him? Is he going to jail? Or He's to arrested, the going to jail, okay. and if he would like to speak with the detective, he can. Okay, so is he gonna have a bond? Probably. All right. I, 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 um. She took all his blinds? Yep. Okay. Company's executive CEO provided a sworn statement affirming that the suspect had never worked for the company. Please raise your right hand. Do you swear or affirm the statement you're about to give? It will be the whole truth, nothing but the truth? Yes, I do. Okay. Put your hand down. Okay. Um, 
I don't remember the actual date that this happened, but um, I think it was Friday. Friday. October. So on Friday, you received a call mm -hmm. in regards to a check. Correct. Being used that was not that you didn't write. Right. Um, the subject that we talked to there was Derek Darby. Have you ever employed Derek Darby? I checked on, we have a lot of employees here that come and go, sometimes temps that we end up hiring full time. But I checked with ADP, he was never registered. And I checked with a manual check that was written on QuickBooks and that was never uh, issued to him. So I don't think he ever worked here. No. I don't think he ever, okay. I don't yeah, think, you... I don't think. Wow, she didn't even take the time out to do her fucking proper research. To they don't be giving a fuck who they lock up. They just got you cannot get a statement, bro, unless they know the fuck what the fuck they talk about. She said, "I think, bro, this shit making me mad because he he's a black educated man, bro." Never heard of no, Derek and I asked Darby. my guys never seen in the him. warehouse. No, I don't know what he looks None like. of them actually. No, never actually seen him. Okay, no. um. What about the cameras? <laughs> when writing checks to employers or employees, mm -hmm. do you ever Photoshop a check? No. Like pre-signature for your the no. business owner? No. Okay. Okay. All right. That's everything I need. After gathering the evidence, he was charged with passing a forged or counterfeit instrument. Share your thoughts in the comments below. What that, and what don't that forget is to that like. like <sighs> Bro. The fact that this man was charged with anything is fucking crazy. They have no evidence showing that he lied about not get like. He did try to cash a check. I, I get it. But like. This shit is sad to me bro. This is. And you see why a lot of niggas in jail for doing shit they never did before? Like, they never even did the crime they committed, bro. My dog ate it up. This is your six... What? When they asked him what he did at the job, he said they make all kinds of stuff. I how was they... How was that funny? <laughs> and when he walked outside, I never done anything like this in a long time. What? Oh, he said I never done it. Okay. Usually the clerk just stand back quietly and let the cop handle everything. I love that this clerk is roasting the scammer to his face. What the fuck is wrong with y'all niggas, bro? Like, even if he did do it, bro, the man wasn't, he wasn't ignorant or nothing, bro. Like, it's too much, so much easier to get a job than. He didn't say the dog ate the envelope, bro. So we show me this guy a job allocation will probably give him a heart attack. What the fuck? Bro. Right, you just proved my point. He said dude is a chump. I allegedly worked there too. But only for three days and a check for... Okay, whatever, bro. <laughs> this is sad, bro. I don't think he did that shit, bro. Y'all niggas need help, G. This show you how much negativity is in the world, bro. I'm done. Y'all go to that video and read all them negative ass comments, bro. I'm not even show y'all that shit. Niggas ain't got no type of, bro.